My name is Hendrik Nollens. I'm a veterinarian here at SeaWorld San Diego, and I want to correct some misinformation. In this video, these two so-called killer whale experts confuse a 10-month-old calf with a nearly three-year-old whale here at SeaWorld San Diego. The 10-month-old calf weighs about 800 pounds. However, the whale you saw in the video is nearly three years old and weighs 2,130 pounds and eats 65 pounds of fish per day. He hasn't been observed to be nursing in several months. However, he does still do the bumping. He does still do a lot of pair swimming and many other behaviors that we consider to be a normal part of developing and maintaining this mom-calf bond. Uh, to me, this error that you saw in this video actually highlights the opportunities that killer whale biologists have uh, to learn and study from the whales here at SeaWorld. Um, killer whale biologists who only work with wild whales very rarely have the opportunity to watch a calf be born, to study nursing patterns and actually observe uh, this mom-calf bond. Resting is a common natural behavior for killer whales. The southern resident killer whale ecotype spends about 10 to 21 percent of their time doing it. The transient killer whale ecotype spends between 2 and 7 percent of their time doing it. Uh, the behavior seems to be equally common in the SeaWorld ki uh, killer whale ecotype. There are many things that we can still learn from the killer whales at SeaWorld. For example, our 10-month-old calf and her mom are currently enrolled in three separate research projects that are all aimed at uh, helping understand and studying the growth and development of killer whale calves both here and in the wild.